Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com and RockAuto.com. Honda's Acura started the Japanese luxury car race and has chalked up some pretty impressive sales numbers. Quite an achievement for a line that consists of only two sedan models. And those models are now far apart. Between the top Integra and the base Legend is a price gap of almost $12,000. A gap big enough to drive a car through. And that's exactly what Acura is doing. It's filling the void with a new model, this mid-size sedan called the Vigor. It's based on Honda's proven Accord design, but uses a new five-cylinder engine. But is a new engine enough to separate the latest Acura from its more common relative? The Vigor is Accord-based, and it shows it in the handsome but derivative four-door hardtop styling. There's a hint of Mercedes in the front and a touch of BMW in the rear. But overall, the look is clearly Japanese and not as distinctive as its larger sibling, the Legend. Many people that we met while driving the Vigor simply assumed that it was a new Honda until they got close enough to see the Acura badge and grille. But once they looked inside, it was obvious that this was a luxury automobile. Leather and wood tone are used extensively in this top grade GS. But even the entry level LS grade features an Audi-like veneer band on the dash and doors. Front seat room is substantial, if down a long tunnel. There's actually more leg room here than in the Legend sedan. We applaud the driver's side airbag, but we have to criticize the Vigor, as we always do Acura sedans, for sparse gauges. Those that are here, however, are large and well placed. The Vigor's seats are well padded and very supportive. However, the standard driver's side power controls are too basic, lacking any height adjustment. Even with the standard tilt wheel and lumbar control, some of our staff never truly got comfortable. Dash controls are logical and generally perfectly placed, just like an Acura should be. The manual climate controls are placed high in the center dash. They're simple to comprehend and well marked. Our car's cassette stereo, however, was something else. It features what Acura calls digital signal processing. It electronically simulates six different listening environments, such as a club, concert hall, and church different types of environments for different types of music. Jazz sounds alive in the club setting, while classical is fullest set on church. A wonderful toy for the hardcore audiophile and one that could become commonplace in luxury automobiles. Our car had a factory sunroof, but the use of weight-saving honeycomb structure in the roof will make aftermarket sunroof installation tricky. The Vigor's wheelbase is over three inches longer than a Honda Accord, yet rear legroom is much less. Even our shortest staff members complained, but there's plenty of head and shoulder room. Trunk room is still substantial at 14.2 cubic feet. Liftover is low, so loading even heavy bags is easy. Much of the shortage of rear legroom can be traced back to the long five-cylinder engine that powers the Vigor. Like the Legend, it is mounted lengthwise, but here the transmission extends further to the car's rear. Power, however, goes to the front wheels through a differential located under the engine, again like the Legend. This 2.5 liter 20 valve engine makes 176 horsepower and 170 pound feet of torque. That's 30 horses less than the Legend, but 30 more than the top Accord. And its performance is, if you'll excuse the pun, invigorating. It hits 60 in 8.3 seconds and finishes the quarter mile in 16.4 seconds at 86 miles per hour. Power delivery is strong, but Acura smooth, with more bottom end punch than one finds in an Accord motor, fitting for the most sporting four-door to wear the Acura name. Honda designed manual shifters are always a strong point in their altogether excellent drivetrains. Like all Acuras before it, the Vigor's five-speed manual is positive and slips into gear with ease. While the Vigor is legend-like and luxury, in our handling test it showed a road character all its own. It uses the same basic suspension configuration as the Legend, but has a much firmer feel. This car feels extremely solid, affixed to the road. The power steering isn't as heavily boosted as that of the larger Acuras either, so it delivers more feedback to the driver. With the Legend four-door becoming softer and the better handling Legend coupe unsuitable for family duty, Acura fans who want a truly sporting sedan will find a home in the Vigor. The Vigor's brakes are all discs with standard anti-lock. They stopped our car from 60 and 126 feet. Stops were straight with a fair amount of ABS pedal pulsation. Nosedive is minimal. The Vigor's off-track performance is very impressive. 
The ride is smooth and quiet, with interior noise measuring a good 68 decibels. EPA mileage estimates are 20 city, 26 highway. We got a most acceptable 24 miles per gallon. Prices for the Vigor start at $23,265. Our top line GS grade test car lists for $25,250, less than the price of a base legend. And the base legend doesn't offer the luxurious wood and leather appointments of our Vigor GS. The Alfa Romeo 164 isn't quite as fancy inside either and will cost you a bit more. It offers similar interior space but more rear legroom and a bigger trunk. But its stirring Italian V6 and spirited handling give it a European panache that the Acura lacks. The Nissan Maxima SE also lacks the luxury appointments of the Vigor, but it counters with a much lower price, similar cargo space, and again more rear legroom. And its fine V6 engine and tight suspension give it similar performance. Hits for the Vigor start with the reasonable price. That's followed by the luxurious interior trim and efficient design. We're also impressed by its fine performance and sporty feel. Plenty of luggage space is another plus. Misses are the lack of front seat height adjustment, very tight rear legroom, and too sparse gauge cluster. In our safety check, the Vigor passes with a driver's side airbag, rear shoulder belts, and anti-lock brakes. A passenger side airbag is not available. The Acura Vigor is definitely more than a Honda Accord with one extra cylinder. It's a very wisely thought out sports sedan addition to the Acura line. An addition that makes the Acura line of four-door sedans the most complete of all the Japanese luxury marks, and one that Acura hopes will soon be stealing buyers from all of its competitors. But if the Vigor cuts into any car's sales, it will likely be those of its more expensive stablemate, the Legend. Many Acura fans will find the Vigor's combination of price, features, and sporty feel hard to pass up.